Hello everybody and welcome to this video of myself and Simon Bates. Uh, we are here to look at the Selma very special black clarinets. Now there's two of these in B flat. Uh, there is the privilege version which I have here in my hand which has the alternate E flat and in fact quite a few differences and there's the presence, I said it in my best uh, <laughs> demi-French, uh, which is part of their Celes range. So Selma brought this Celes range out a couple of years ago and there's a Celes Axos alto sax, for example. The idea was to modify the designs but bring them in at a slightly more affordable price. Um, it's The one in Simon's hand is similar-ish to an R13RC in terms of where we think of it as comparable quality uh, on the buffets. But obviously the striking thing about these is, is the finish. Mm -hmm. uh, you don't see many clarinets with, with black keys. There may or may not be a good reason, I'm not sure. I personally quite like it, but what's your first feeling on the look? Yeah, I, th I think they look great. Yeah, it does Absolutely look cool. fantastic, yeah. Uh, the finish is like a matte textured uh, finish on them as well. So, but let's hear a little bit of this. This is the Présence. <laughs> Sounds like a clarinet. Yeah. Uh, it's the Selmas generally, I find, uh, this is what I'm going to ask you, have that slight tubbiness, there's a sort of richness mm -hmm. to them as well. Definitely, but yeah. What's your first feeling? Um, yeah, nice, rich, uh, fairly bright sound from this one. Um, it's still good plenty control. Of projection. Yeah, plenty of projection, good control, uh, intonation's good. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I like it. Cool. Well, let's try the privilege back to back. So. Actually, it's interesting because the privilege is designed more for the very classical end of things, mm -hmm. whereas this Présence or Celeste, whether they designed it like this or not, I'm not quite sure, but we've found quite a lot of the doublers and players who maybe do more of the commercial work actually quite like this because there's that brightness and liveliness yeah. to it. Um, but yeah, let's try. This is the privilege. <laughs> Very restrained of you, Simon. Yes. <laughs> um, it's a really warm sound. I like it. Um, yeah. In terms of the comparison, would you say maybe this is a little livelier? Yeah, I'd say it probably maybe... is a little livelier. This is, this is a very round sound. It's a very nice sound. Uh, yeah. I think potentially, and certainly how they're designed, that might be more of the clarinet player's clarinet, if you, if you uh, know what I mean. Absolutely, yeah, I know what you mean. So more on the classical Entirely, end of yeah. things. Yes, yeah, yeah. Um, and they, the wood they choose on the privilege is a slightly higher spec um, compared to the presence. So there is a slight, well, not a slight, there's a fairly big gap in the pricing. So it would be something we would encourage you to try, and if it's actually going to be worth that jump, it might depend on the sort of work you're doing. Mm. Um, but in terms of how they play, maybe compared to, say, a buffet or, for example, I know you're, you use the Yamaha as well. Mm -hmm. How do you think these sit and how, maybe how do they vary in tone compared to those? Um, yeah, I mean, my, my Yamaha is, is a brighter clarinet. I, I use an SE and I guess I'm, I'm more used to playing it. Um, but, uh, you know, this definitely has the projection. It has the, the, the warmness, uh, the rich tone that, that, that you want. Um, yeah, feels lovely. Looks absolutely stunning. He's getting, he's getting a bit, you're getting a bit attached to it. No. I do like it. <laughs> yeah, like that. he'll be taking yeah, his in. I'm not sure about the extra E flat key. I can no. never get on with those. I keep on knocking them. So yeah. uh, I'm a bit old school when it comes to that. But yeah. uh, you can take it off. Actually, but it's interesting. A lot of the manufacturers vary where they put those, and um, mm. I probably potentially. Uh, it depends on your size of hand as to which one you think sits better. But cool. Well, let's let's have a little bit of the privilege then, just to play us out and uh, see how we go. <laughs> 